Welcome back to Tabletop Tactics and to this double codex debut as the Adeptus Sororitas take on the uprising of the Gene Stealer Cults. Led by Saint Celestine, the Bringers of Flame carry the fiery wrath of the Emperor to purge his enemies and illuminate the darkest corners of the Imperium. Lying in wait, however, is the brood surge of the Gene Stealer Cults. Amongst endless waves of hybrids, colossal mutant beasts submerge with murderous instincts and swarms of gene stealers thunder across the battlefield and stalk from the shadows. Which of these two factions will come out on top? Let's hand over to the players and check out their lists. Next time, baby! We're gonna kick things off with the Sisters of Battle. I'm using the Bringers of Flame detachment from this new tome. If you wanna find out all about all the detachments, just head over to On Demand. We've got a whole breakdown, along with all of the um, other factions in 40k that have been done so far. So if you wanna find out all about it, all there is to know, that's where you go. Sign up now and you can discover everything there is to know about the Sisters of Battle. But for today, we're focusing on the Bringers of Flame. Uh, it allows me to have plus one strength to any weapons that I use uh, within 12 inches of the enemy, and I get assault and everything, which is very nice indeed. It feels very Sisters of Battle. Flame and fast. Speaking of flame and fast, Saint Celestine is my warlord for today. She does some fire with her fire sword. Um, she is joining a unit of Zephyrim. She's actually able to bring them back to life with her healing tears, which is wild. Um, so she is leading the force today and she is very good indeed. I'm not gonna cover all the changes because pretty much every, every date sheet has been changed a little bit. We'll do it when we get into the game. I've got two Cannoness. Uh, they are both going to be joining a unit of Retributors, which is new. They can change. They can join those, which is very, very cool indeed. We have Junith. Junith is here. She likes the flame, so she had to be here. Um, she is joining a unit of Battle Sisters, a unit of 10 of them. They have a Simulcrum and all the good stuff they normally like to take. I also have another unit of Battle Sisters, and they are joined by a Palatine and a Hospitaller. The Hospitaller can actually uh, bring the battle sisters themselves back to life rather than just characters, which is a very nice change for those battle sisters that would otherwise be dead. I have three immolators because I needed to bring the flame. I have two of them which will be carrying the retributors and the other one I can't remember, but I'm sure we'll find out soon enough. I have a couple of exorcists. You could argue the missiles make flame, uh, but they're very good. Um, they're a bit different as well and I'll cover those when we get to the game too. I've got two units of Paragon war suits. I've given one of them the maces and the other ones the swords. Other than that, they all have, guess what? The heavy flamers, hooray! And well, oh, that's it. That's everything. I, I took as much flame as I can. Um, lots of flame, lots of fast, lots of fury, lots of righteous. Oh, I also have an enhancement called Righteous Fury. That was a good um, segue. That's on one of the, the cannonets, which is nice. Better. Rising from the shadows to take on the Adeptus Sororitas today is the rebellion of the Gene Stealer Cults, who also have a brand new codex. This is a very exciting time for the worshippers of the Star Gods, of which I usually am a patron, but now I am a cultist myself, so I feel like I'm going down in the ranks, but it's still a good time. I'm taking the Biosanctic Brood today, so that is for my Pure Stain Gene Stealers and my Aberrants and a Biophagus get plus one to their charge rolls and plus one attack on the turn that they charge. So those nice big abominations are now even scarier, which is very cool. So in true Gene Stealer Cult fashion, I am being led up by a Patriarch. He is leading a squad of 10 Gene Stealers and I have another squad of 10 Gene Stealers on the flanks just for a fun time. I do have an Abominant as well, leading a squad of 10 Aberrants. For the rest of the cult leadership, we have a Nexos and a Primus who are going to be followed up by their newest member, the Benefictus. We'll see if that benefits us in the battle today. I will see myself out. For my battle line, taking the streets by swarm, it is three squads of neophyte hybrids, just as they are. I then have two squads of five acolyte hybrids with auto pistols my nice choppy ones, and a big squad of 10 with hand flamers because they are now separate 
which is very cool for them. And assisting them in their cultish endeavours, I have two Goliath rock grinders, just because they look cool and they're big and spinny and they look very scary, and two Achilles Ridge Runners for my firepower. That is the list. It is time for us to rise up and appease the Star Gods. Ah! It's a juicy lookout all along. It's an uprising. We've got new and improved uprising bits. Look at you guys. Look at us go. Resourceful. Double new pages. Double new bits. Uh, great uprising. Righteous flame. Yeah. It's the light right. of the emperor is shining upon you. I hope so. I believe it is. Yeah. In we've, some way. We've got new rules, new data sheets, we've got a new mission pack. It's all happening! Everything's new, nothing right is the same. No, but not everything is here. We have everything. There's loads of stuff going up this weekend mm -hmm. on demand. We've got two new battle reports next week. We've got the faction focuses right now on demand. Right now! If you want to find out everything, because there's a lot of changes with these two factions, you can yes. head over to on demand, sign up, and look at the faction focuses. We've got a rundown of the brand new missions as well. Run! New missions, yep. new secondaries, new primary rules, yeah. new deployments. Yeah, yeah. Change. It was good. And if you don't want to do that, just uh, hit like and subscribe. That, that, that's fine too. Yeah. If you want to do that, that also helps. Let's start things off. Um, I'm interested to see how these two go. Yeah. Yeah. Why don't you roll, roll your Why dice? I'm roll my dice. Mm. That was a very promising start. That was a promising start. It, it was double, double my, my surprise roll. worked. That was my tactic to scare your dice into not letting you go first. <laughs> One. But you, you're doing some sneaky shenanigans. <laughs> well, with, the, with this new mission, I've, I've elected to do smoke and mirrors. So I can I've, I've put these Paragon War suits into strategic reserve. Kept them safe. It was all an elaborate route. Very good. Um, I've brands. done my scout move with my Ridge Runners. Nice. So we've both been a bit sneaky. I've drawn my secondaries. I've got um, no prisoners, which is the same as it is. And then I've got the new Deploy Teleport Homer, which is called... Established Locus. Established Locus, that's good, because I can remember what it was called. <laughs> so, both achievable. Nice. I'm hoping to do some murders. Oh. Kicking off the movement phase with the ever-eager Doom Stealers. I'm going to come towards an immolator. See if they can dull some of that flame. And the Patriarch is leading this squad also into battle. And the Ridge Runners are also going to be aggressive, as the Dune Steel Cults should be with their uprising, and move on to this objective. The Rock Grinder will move forward to establish a locus onto this objective. And this Rock Grinder is moving out, taking the benefit of cover. The Aberrants are moving up behind the Rock Grinder because they figure that's where the rocks are, and they want to smash them with their giant hammer. We're in my shooting phase and I'm going to be performing some actions. My rock grinder in the middle is establishing a locus. Nice. Uh, for, the, for the hive mind to come join us, num num num. And my neophytes down here are terraforming mm. my home objective. Nice. Which is very cool. We now move into the shooting phase. I've already attempted to shoot my stubbers into your paragon since I did do a wound. You did do a wound. You know, it's a heavy mining laser. Yeah. It's one shot. Okay. I hit on force. Nice. Oh, would you want threes? My goodness! I, I would you. And minus three. Four up save. The light of the emperor shines fondly upon my righteous brow, visage. More mug. Bridge runners next, hmm. and this is actually the last of my shooting. I'm going to put my twin heavy stubbers into your sisters, and my mining lasers into your immolator. I might. I see you've done something. I have. I've used a very, it's one of my favourite strategies from this detachment. It's called Blazing Ire. And it means that when you shoot one of my transports, the unit inside can jump out. <laughs> and they can shoot you after you've done your shots. Quite rude. It's very rude. Yeah. Well, I'm going to start going to the sisters first because I'm unhappy with them. Um, I do have spotters on these. So they get the plus one ballistic skills. They are hitting on threes. Nice. Wounding on threes. Nice. You are in rapid fire range and they are twin linked. So that is two, four, six, eight. No IP, but you are in cover. In cover. 
Ah, oh, three of them have fallen. Oh, so oh. sad for them. But they shall rejoice in the Emperor's holy flame. And into the immolator, I get three, four, five shots. Oh. Again, hit me, please. Hit me, please. The spotter, having a spotter is quite nice. Oh, it seems to be very nice. Yes. Need you on three. So it's three ones at AP3, so onto your. Oh! Oh, cheeky devil! Go through? My goodness, yeah. D6 plus one damage. Okay. Ah. Oh. Two? <laughs> Something? <laughs> I killed three sisters. It's all good. It's time for you to receive the blazing ire. Now. I don't want to be burnt. Didn't roll super hot. Crispy Ridge Runner. On the uh, on the on the flames. Th these are all. Oh, it's not bad though. So uh, because this is um, the fire detachment, I get plus one strength. So when you go on fours. And you do reroll ones. I do reroll ones. For I'm a retributor. Retribution. Yep. For those sisters. So that is seven wounds at minus one, please. Five, six, seven, four up saves on my Ridge Runners. I take four damage. My goodness, that is some hot fire. I believe they've got six wounds, our resident gene stealer. Uh, I think you're being a bit unkind to the Ridge Runners. They've got more than six wounds. Okay. We'll double check. We'll see. Bit. The plasma pistol. Goodbye. Pistol. The plasma pistol. It is a is wound, it? yes. It is a wound because you're nice, overcharging. Nice three. Of course I'm overcharging every time. Oh, What's the damage? Damage two. Damage two. I'm taking six wounds. Then finally we have the, <gasps> the brazier of holy fire. This is a once per game. The brazier of holy ire, more Ooh! like. Oh no. That is quite awesome. Ooh! So this will also be strength seven. So force to wound. Reroll the ones because you're in the unit. I'm on then. It's oh. three wounds. These are minus one, but these are damage two. <laughs> Oh! I take two. So I've taken ten damage total. That would be dead. it would be four damage because they're damaged two. But ten, 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 ten. Yes. Total. Holy fire! Ah! Holy flame! Very brief shooting phase as the rock grinder in the middle is performing an action. So now charges. Oh. This is my favourite bit as a Tyranid player. My gene stealers are going to do a multi charge to your retributors and your sisters. Oh my goodness! Because I can. I'm standing on a dice that's confusing my brain. That is just one dice. Just the one. <laughs> Only two. So confident. I definitely make it in with and whatever number that is. And then the other gene stealers are going to charge your immolator. Uh oh. They may right encircle you in entomb you. Very in nice. Your fiery doom. An offering for the star gods. That's a lot of dice. Fifty dice. Uh. So you need a ten gene stealer looks at him plus one attack on the charge. Um, I've also upgraded them with gene twisted muscle. Ooh. Ooh want to wound you, it's a new stratagem for us. And it's 50 dice. I'm gonna figure out what all this means. It's 18 wounds Lots. from 50 dice. Uh, this is a little bit minus two. That plus one to wounds, very nice. Yes, it's quite tasty. Makes them quite good anti-tank. Oh, I've saved, I've saved a okay. few of them. Oh, is that all right? You have. Three, six, no, I mean, I'm still dead. I'm do still you, dead. Do you explode in holy fire? I hope so. It, oh. oh. No. Oh. Snuffed out like the, the, the Emperor's wick. They're nothing but smoke now. Oh, I've got... Um, smoke and mirrors. Uh, so this is the unit with... Nice. Thank you. Okay. This is the unit with the Retributors and a Cannoneth. Okay. Um, I've, I've taken it well. One of them's dead. Sacrificed. Sacrosalt. You jumped out your Retributors and I did pile into them with, with my gene stealers where I could. Now down here, yeah. I've got a split. I've got five gene stealers that can attack your retributors. Can't say the word correctly. And five that can go into your battle sisters. And then the patriarch. The patriarch's going into the retributors. <sighs> retributors. With my horrible claws. Huh. Oh. He only hits you oh. three times. But he does wound on two. Yeah. And he gets devastating. It's just two. Just the two? He's twin linked. He's twin linked. Well, that's devastating. From a one to a dev. Two, a minus three. Oh. Got three dead. Oh. Uh, it's minus two unless it was crossfired. It was not crossfired, but I think that's still. They're still dead. They're still dead. Yeah, two, I've two. then got the rest of the gene stealers to go into them. Well, the rest of the gene stealers did 20 wounds, which have taken out the squad, but not the cannoness yet. Cannoness is in the process of doing her. Um, well, I can't remember what's it called, blessed by the Emperor or something, but it I've got blessed. a tough and vulnerable save till into this phase, once per battle. She, she's, she's soaked up nine wounds so yep. far. Um, so I've got three more, basically I've, I've lost, I'm down to one wound. Yes. Got four to go. Yep. I've got one, two. In your miracle dice pool. In my pool. 
So I'm going to do these one at a time. Okay. If she dies, she dies. If we get to the end, she can have the two. <gasps> Last one. <gasps> oh, she's a rose! Oh, she's a rose! What By a legend! The, the grace of the emperor. Yes. Uh, it's time to strike you back. Yeah. It's the very sister of battle thing to do. So this is the canoness with the righteous fury enhancement. It's very angry. So as she's nearly died, she's going to spend two of the miracle dice. Because I've got quite a few this time. She yeah. killed quite a lot of stuff. Um, She's going to spend two of my miracle dice, so I add plus two to my attacks and my strength. That's really cool. Oh, yeah, bro. That's really cool. Right, so this is with a hallowed chain sword. Hello. Hi. I rolled two ones, so those extra two attacks meant nothing. But they sort it of It would have been two misses you would have had in addition to your old ones. Exactly. I'll be strength uh, five now, so fours to wound. Uh, it's three wounds. Three to wound. Mine. Yes. Four wounds at minus one, please. Oh, I have my invulnerable save. Wing. Three. What's the damage? Cuts down three to damage one. Oh, so it cuts down one. Two, oh, they've got two wounds. Oh, I mean, it's but quite you do have Junus and an immolator that I did pile into. You hit me back. Well, you continued hitting me back over there. You killed a total of four gene stealers, um, finishing them off with the immolator and Junus. Yeah. Retributors. They didn't do so. Good. They want to shoot. Bless them. They're here to shoot. shoot. They're not here to do anything yeah. else. But that is my turn one done. Very nice. With this first new turn. army. New codex and new missions. Yeah. I do get the five, four no prisoners. Mm. And I definitely uh, did. The locust. Yes, I created yeah. a locust. Yes. So I have points. I've terraformed my home objectives and yeah. got some primaries. It's very exciting. Here you go. It's like a whole new world. <laughs>I've drawn Secure No Man's Land and Assassinate. My bait shop might be in a spot of bother. Very interesting, I would, mm. I would tell mm. you. Um, I've spent one of my new miracle die to transform it into a command point with yes. Junith. She's being sworn, sworn by Gene Stevens, but she's, she's very smart. Smart, smart cookie. Yes. Um, so there's some stuff to do, there's some stuff to run away from, and some stuff to ignite. With Holy Flame. Yeah. Get in the van, they're mental gene stealers. Look at the size of that patriarch, says the immolator driver. We're going to advance, run away, um, onto this objective. And uh, because it's assault, I can still shoot, which is very exciting. Junith has had enough of these pesky gene stealers. She's going to um, float over this way and escape certain death. The Exodus is just going to move backwards just a smidge because the target is sighted over that way. And then we're going to move forward with the Battle Sisters, make sure all of our bolters are in range to light up these Gene Stealers. These emulators realize they cannot win a fist fight, so they're going to fall back away from these Gene Stealers. The Paragon Warsuits over here are going to move as far as they can, not advancing, just in case I can make a big charge into that Goliath. Last thing to move, this immolator. I have used one of my fours to advance. So it's going to fly over this way with the Battle Sisters on board. The shooting phase beginner. I am going to... So this is the one with the configuration rockets. Those are all going to fire into the Gene Stealers in front mm -hmm. because they need to die. Yeah. Um, as is the heavy bolter. My Hunter Killing Missile is going to go into the Ridge Runner over there. Very nice. Going to go nice. for a little trick shot, perhaps. The conflagration missiles. Oh, oh, conflagrated. <laughs> that's that's one of their favourite hymns. Is it? Oh, conflagrated. <laughs> oh, conflagrated gene stealer. <laughs> yeah. This is our new song. Three, six, eight wounds six, at six, minus seven, one. Eight on my own bones. Why not? I've done not too bad. Done very well. That is two and a half gene stealers dead. Okay. Oh, there's still a lot left. The heavy bolter. Uh, three hits. The heavy bolter. De de uh, they're tough, tough as four, right? Yeah. Two wounds. Two wounds? Yes, please. Two more decks. They're damaged two. Damaged two, yes. That's four dead gene stealers. Then the hunter killer missile. Rocket, I mean. It's a hit. It's, it's a wound. I definitely don't oh. save that. I've only got six wounds remaining. <gasps> My goodness! I explode! The light of the Emperor! I don't explode! I'm I'm very impressed though. It's never been done! It's never been done! My goodness. Immolator number two. Immolation stations. With the hero canoness inside. Uh, she's actually um, taking hold of the flames herself. Oh, she's actually using it. Wow. Yeah. She's cool. Vengeance. 
He's very cool. Um, the uh, Canon S in the Malaysia Flame is going to go into the Gene Stealers there. Yep. The Heavy Bottles are going to go over here because they are a problem. Skewie. They're alive. Very we'll skewy. do the, the Immolation Flame first. Okay. Immolation. Oh, that's nice. Right on. Three, six, seven, eight wounds, please. What's the damage of the Immolation Flame? Just one. Just one? Uh, one dead gene stealer, two yeah. dead ge 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 gene stealer, three dead gene stealer. Nice! One, ah, two, ah, three! Ah. Yeah! Okay, and, and your heavy bolter. Heavy bolter! Heavy bolter! Three hits! Okay. Heavy bolter! Three wounds! Do, 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 do. Two more dead! She's also on the heavy bolter. Ah. Yeah. She's a multifunctional woman. She sure is. The Exorcist with the Exorcist missile launcher. But I'm not a demon. Huh? Not a demon. You might be. I'm a G stealer. Can't be too sure. Right. <laughs> um, the missile launcher and the heavy and uh, the hunter killer missile is going to fire into that rock grinder over there. It'll be fine. Heavy bolt is going to continue to lay down the pain train on those gene stealers because be they fine. they do me a frighten. I, oh, I missed three times. It's good for me. It's good you for have, the gene stealers. You have We've sabotaged your uh, your, in, your, your your exorcist. It is three wounds. Isn't on the rock grinder. Three? Yeah. I saved none. Is it a two up save? Not three up. Oh no. The damage. You've locked out again. It's eight wounds. I have two left. The hunter killer missile. Oh. Will it be a hunter thriller? Oh. Oh. Uh, Sad. I'm alive on two wounds, though. You are indeed. The heavy bolter. The heavy bolter. Blop, 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 Sustained. Blop. Oh no. That's more, that's more dice than I've got gene stealers. Three wounds. Oh, the dream's alive. <laughs> Oh! Now, the unit's dead. Uh-oh. Is it actually dead? Oh, no! You can't stop the gene stealer! That's very ominous. No one, no one puts gene stealer in a corner. <laughs> Summarising a couple of bits. So I've done one more dead gene stealer. One more dead gene stealer? I've done one more You're dead gene stealer. Dead. With the That's the deal sisters. you gave me. Yes, deal. yes, agreement. Yeah. Uh, the Palatine <laughs> failed to kill anything with a plasma pistol, but never mind. At least she didn't blow herself up. She did not. So go her. She, she is, she's, yes. Uh, the emulator over here attempted to uh, incinerate that Goliath and failed miserably. Now it happened. But now it's time for the Paragon War suits. Yes. Yes. Um, they are going yes. to flame you up quite nicely. Well, guess what? I wounded you thrice. Thrice? That's thrice okay. times. I think it's, oh, I can't remember, it's one or two. Well. Doesn't matter with that, Regardless, it? it's just going to be two wounds. Marvellous. And then we have the Paragon Grenade Launchers. Okay. I hit you once. I don't wound you. Whilst we're here, I've got okay. one charge one to do, charge. which is them. Big charge. The big charge. Big charge. Into a big target. Big. <gasps> oh! oh you got Paragon War suits. Bases ahoy! That's the noise my mace makes. That's quite cool. What kind of mace is it? A righteous mace? Righteous a hallowed mace. Mace of absolution. Whatever it is. I'm doing a tank shot yes. first. I know I must apologise. They get plus one to wound vehicles and monsters they do. And to hit. So I should have been wounding on fours. But it doesn't matter because I'm going to You're kill gonna you kill me now, now anyway. Yeah. Uh, I should also mention that we didn't get sent the books or the cards or anything on time from Games Workshop. So we work on a PDF. It's very difficult with two armies and all of the rules and one screen to work off. Fine. You know? It's, it's hazily transmitted data. Into These are our, into unreasonable our working conditions. You're I have twos. This is, what? You're right. This is my twos. tank shot. Oh. Shocking! It's fives and sixes for tank shot, not fours. I always make that mistake. It is the big six. It's actually seven. So I have two wounds remaining. Shoulder barge. Two, two, two wounds. Go, go straight into your attacks. I will. Go I for it. I think they're hallowed maces. Hallowed maces. Hallowed. Hi. Thanks for coming. Uh, I don't think I'm going to be here for very long. I think I'm stopping by for a short time. Maybe. Yeah. It's going to be twos to wounds. Yeah. Because of the plus one to wound. Oh my goodness. Six wounds. Now minus it's only minus one, one so yes. you get a four up save, but. If one of these go through, I'm dead. Oh, really dead. Really quite dead. <laughs> Ooh, oh, imagine. Oh, they've actually maced it up into the sky. Yeah. Oh, oh. So strong. Like Team Rocket blasting off again. They don't explode. No. There's nothing inside. We're Team Rocket. Up again. Ah, ding. <laughs> That's the end of my turn. That's it. Very impressive. That was a very, a very brutal show of battle force. round. Yeah, we, we both took chunks out of each other, as we should in this brutal and bloody civil war in which I will murder. Oh, wow, that's frightening. Um, I have secured <laughs> yeah. no man's land. 
They're really into character. I was gonna say something cool about like tooth and claw and fire and flame, and then I was like, oh, I've been overwhelmed by your words. <laughs> My power <laughs> is exponentially growing. I am going to hold on to assassinate, because yeah, I, I would know. like to assassinate that patriarch. He's quite vulnerable. He is. More so than he was. Indeed. So I'm gonna hold on to that. I've got secure. Very nice. Um, I have forgotten to do any terraforming. It's I don't think I would have wanted to anyway, no. if I even if I had. You don't want to terraform. You want this planet to stay exactly as it is. Yes. Because this is an imperial planet, whereas I want to terraform and make it good for the Tyranids. So instead, I'll just form terror. Hmm. My turn too. I've drawn engagement fronts. It's very nice, very, very nice. Yes, very artistic me. I've also drawn Marked for Death. Oh. It's a brand new secondary. So you have to pick three of your units yeah. on the field. Yeah. And if I kill any one of them, I get five victory points. Very nice. Yeah, very cool. That's very nice. I'm going to pick my two exorcists because they're quite far back. And I'm also going to pick my Paragon War suits as well. Tempting target for me. Yeah. Very tempting. Target has been acquired. Must die. The rock grinder moving towards the Paragon Warsuits. Incredibly eager, the Aberrants run six on their charge, like the legends that they are, so they are storming up the battlefield. Come and claim it. The Gene Stealers, led up by the Patriarch, are then going to move this way towards your unit battle sisters. You have knocked off my favourite cannoness. Knocking off your cannoness. And for your hubris, your alien hubris, I'm going to flame you. Not my hubris. With Overwatch from Junith and her twin Ministorum Heavy Flame. Two pieces of flame. Just two flames. One for each funnel. Or is it a spout? I don't know. Oh, um, nice. It's two wounds and minus one, please. Just damage one. That kills a gene stealer. Mm. Snuffed out. Marvellous. Behold, the cult has emerged. They're everywhere. You're surrounded on all sides. Oi, oi, oi. Um, so we've started the shooting phase. Kicked it off. Yeah. Yep. With the heavy stubbers from my Goliath into your Paragon Wars. I've done a wound. Well, that's nice for you. Which is quite funny. Yeah. Now I'm going to go with my demolition cache because I'm in rage. This is fun. Nice. Got four shots. Look at all that demolition. Hit three times. I hit you three times, I wound you on three. Please don't demolish me. I uh -oh. want to. Ooh, that is three at minus two. I passed two of them. But one goes through and it's two damage each. One of them is dead. It's dead. Does she explode? She does explode. Do, did, does that unit explode? I'll have to find out. We'll figure seconds. out what that means. My mining laser though, I've got two shots. One now, because I dropped my dice. Yeah. Hit your fourth. Only you nuts, only you nuts. Marked for death. Oh. As they already are. Minus three. Ooh. Invulnerable save. <gasps> Legends. Scholars. Absolute ladies. Continue cheating phase. My acolytes down here did nothing to your paragon war suits. The acolytes down here did take a wound off of your emulator. Nice. Which is hilarious. Now I've started with the neophytes down here so far with my um, hybrid weapons. But I've not done anything to your paragon war suits. However, heavy mining laser. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. But I do have a crack grenade. You do? To go into you. I hit all fours. Never mind. Never mind. Ah, they've got a primus in them. They reroll their hits. The crack hits. There you go. Wounds. Minus two. Minus two. Holy life. And then the mining laser. Would not have hit because it hits on fives. It's on fives? Yeah, it's heavy. Oh. Last bit of shooting. Last unit of neophytes. Nervous. You should be. So the rest of the squad has a shot and has done a wound into your exorcist. Yes. I now have the mining laser, grenade launcher, and the benefactors to go. She's scary. She is scary. I'm going to build up to her. I'm going to start the crack grenade. Okay. Here's a crack grenade. Here's a crack grenade. Crack grenade. Oh. Wounds on a three. Minus two. Oh. Wait, it's, what's the strength? It's strength nine. Never mind. Grenade. Doesn't doesn't wound. Yeah. Ignore me. Mining laser. Yes. <gasps> Hits. Hits. I don't want to be lethal. Lethal! Minus three. Hup! Oh, goodbye. Goodbye. Oh. It's DC plus one damage. Oh! Four. Four. Four damage. All right, I've got six wounds left. My psionic wave. No, thank you. This is from your benefactors, is yes. it? 
mind. How many size. attacks does it have? It's two. If you're overcharging, it's two. It hits you once. No. I'm gonna spend a CP to reroll it because he would. deserves it. It's a wound. Minus, minus three. Minus three? Oh no. Six plus one. <laughs> Oh, I've damaged. So close. It's got oh. one wound left. One wound left? Yeah. Maybe I'll see if I can charge it. Mm -hmm. I have charges to do, but I do need to see if the benefit is if she explodes. Yeah. Close. Not quite. Close. Mind-bending magic happening yeah. here. Right, charges. We're going to go with the acolytes down there into a paragon war suits. Uh -oh. See if I can kill them. They make. No! Oh. Why did I pick them? I thought it'd be cool! I'm the rock grinder! <laughs> oh, most definitely, and I probably will be tank shocking down there. I've then got the acolytes down here going into the immolator. Just, just why not? Yeah, why not? No, no. The gene stealers. Let me go into Junith and the battle system. Okay. Yes. And then the neophytes, we'll see if they can get a final chip off that exorcist, because why not? Sure. They make it in. Oh! It's an charge. I might have found my puppy. <laughs> tank shot. Mm, tank, 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 tank shot. With my drill dozer blades Woo! going into your power of your suits. Woo! It's only two, but oh. it's fine. I right. softened you up for my drill dozer blades. Mm. Which I've got eight attacks, so I've done two wounds already. I remember that for later. It's very important. Hit you on fours because I am damaged. Two wins. Minus three. two. Minus three. Two. Minus two. two. Oh. Invulnerable two. Holy, holy emperor. Oh. So one is dead. One is dead. One is dead. You ground. Oh, my, oh, you ground oh. it up. Oh, I got put oh, into I the. I got paragon. Into the thing. It's in my, in my rock grinder. Paragon. Ha. Nice one. My acolyte hybrids then. Try and see if I can finish off my heavy mining tools. Oh, please don't mine me. I would like to. You've been laser. Oh. You've been lasered. You've been mined. You've been crushed. Demolished. What's going to happen next? I'm hitting really on fours. Okay. okay, okay. That is three at minus two, please. Minus two. Three at minus two. Holy Emperor. Save me, Bacon Emperor. Oh, what's the damage? Three. One's got a wound left. I've got my leader's attacks. Been quite, quite heavily mined. My leader's. It hits you twice. Have we got one wound left? No wounds. Oh! And the others aren't in engagement range. Oh! So can pile in enough. It's a miracle. I'm alive on a wound. No. Turns out I can get some wounds through on your exorcist. Two to be precise. You stabbed me right in the tank. No AP. No AP. Oh. Legendary. Super tank. Legendary. So no death there. We're going to go straight into the Patriarch and the Gene Stealer. Patriarch into Gene, Gene Stealer into Battle Sisters. Mm -hmm. Starting with the Patriarch. Okay. Two's to hit. Uh -oh. I hit you all the times. <laughs> this time. <laughs> Junith, no more. Oh! Twin linked. Right in the pulpit. Right in the pulpit, indeed. Two, four, five at minus two. You got a Debbie there. One is a Debbie, so four at minus two. Is it into Junith? Yes. So six, uh, four up saves. Oh. There's two, four, six damage, and then the Debbie. Oh! She's dead! She's dead. Does she blow up? Roll it and we'll see. I don't oh. think she does. You killed my Junith! I'm going to kill your battle sisters now. No! I'm going to kill them dead. I hate you all the times. No. Okay. That is three at minus two. Three at minus two. You've killed two more. And a Devi. You've killed three more. Murder! Brutal! <laughs> We're fighting back. With, with the rapturous blows, yeah. I managed to finish off a gene stealer. You did. I did a wound and then a mortal wound. Oh, poor gene stealer. Did nothing to deserve it. Well, now I'm going to slay your patriarch with my palatine. Patriarch. Palatine, patriarch, punishing... Party. Yes. I've hit you three times. Very good. Pretty sure she hits on two. Yeah, sure. Um, I'll give it. Wounding on five. Very tough. Yes. Two wounds. Two. Four up. Invulnerable. <laughs> Saves one <gasps> damage. So damage two plus a mortal wound because of Hits my rapturous wounds. blows. Got three left. Hurt. Yes. Wounded. Uh, Katie, do your gene stealers come back? <gasps> no, come thanks. Back. Yes. Why? Yes. 
last thing to do. Mm -mm. Revenge for I our fallen sororitas. I want it. The lofty mace held lofty don't above mace your... Don't up into the sky. Shrek, I've hit you twice. Okay. I'm hitting on twos. Mm. Mm. I'm going to spend one of my miracle die to ensure the wounds. Okay. Because I want to kill your truck. There's two wounds. Minus? Minus one. Damage three. <gasps> the truck goes. That's the second truck that they've just maced into space. Bang, bang, bang! We're blasting up again! <laughs> That's the end of my turn. Mm. I'm engaged on every single one of the fronts. You have. You cannot see any space that doesn't have a Gene Steel Occult in it. Everywhere. You are still marked for death, but you have two marked for death units that are on a single wound. So I'm going to be holding on to that. I understand that. Because you might just die. Oh, I forgot to do my feel no pains from my hospitaler. Um, so I have put one back because yeah. I rolled for them afterwards. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah, but uh, yeah, some of my some of my prime time targets are looking a little bit worse than where. Weak. My turn too. See if we can heat some things up. Ha! Ha ha! Because with the bringer of flame. Yeah. Warm. Detachment. Spicy. Yes. Um, so there's some stuff I need to do. I've still got uh, assassinate, but I've also drawn a fun new mission, secondary mission, but, uh, called sabotage. You can't sabotage the saboteurs. I, apparently I can. Ooh. I need to uh, get towards one of your terrain features in your deployment zone, mm -hmm. and as an action, I can sabotage it. That means I can't come up from a tunnels anymore. Yeah, I'm gonna uh, put a, a them. cache of holy hand grenades on them. And then pull the pin. <laughs> yeah. Um, so there's some stuff to do, some stuff to bring in, but first we must do our holy moves. First things first, she's licked some wounds. She's disembarking the, the hero cannoness, limps over here to place the holy hand grenade, grenade cache. And then my immolator's gonna move back over here just to stop some charge later on to have some flame in range. Over this way, the Battle Sisters are falling back from this monstrous beast to open up some flame highways. Heavy Flamer Retributors will about turn and they will unleash howly gouts of holy flame <laughs> upon the Patriarch. The Exorcist is going to advance over this way just get some line of sight onto those mining tooled clowns. Last few things to do. My Paragon Warsuit is going to stumble backwards, escaping from the fight. My Battle Sisters have disembarked from this immolator over here, which is then in turn advancing over here around the corner to get its holy flame in range of those near fights. Well, look at that! Look at it go. Descending from the sky above. Her angelic wings. The holyest of holy saints, Celestine, has arrived. We. Well, she's double scary now because previously she just heal and revive her Gemini. Yeah. Now it's the entire bodyguard unit. Great. So she has uh, 14 ablative wounds. Yeah. Effectively, which I then don't can like be that. healed and. I must. Crush it. It might, it might, it might be a bit much. Yeah, we'll see. It might be we'll a bit much. We'll just have to find out. Um, it's worth mentioning you did move your immolator within nine inches of my blip. Yes. And I spent a command point on invas evasive vanguard to move it six inches away. So now, because it is more than nine away from your immolator, I can still use it. it doesn't disappear. The only caveat being only gene stealers are allowed to come up from this blip now. Crazy. Uh, my other unit of Paragon Warsuits have arrived over there as well from the Strategic Reserve. I'm going to go into the shooting phase. I'm going to do a stratagem down okay. here with my Retributors. I think it's called Rites of Flame, mm -hmm. where my torrent weapons become devastating wounds. I like that, it's scary. Let's see how many pieces of flame. Oh, it's pretty hot! That is warm and toasty. That is pretty hot. Uh, uh, 12, 15, 17, 18, 20. There we yes. go. Go on the brain. Brain. You did it, it's 20, well done. I did. That was quick math. That was. Well, it was actually very slow math. Well, that includes the 20 I needed. Oh, clever. Smart. Yeah. Uh, your toughness is five? Yeah. Three to wound you. Because, oh. Oh. Well, it's four devies. He's only had three wounds. 
He's been absolutely... Patriarch, no! He's been cremated. Poor Patrick. Holy flame, holy fire, righteous retribution! Speechless. My immolator has, has immolated. The one over there has done, between its uh, flamer and the heavy bolts, has done eight, 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 eight kills. Not anymore. Now you're. Now you're. Just... I mean, they weren't innocent at all. They were. No. Culturists. They were culturists. Incredibly culturists. Uh, <coughs> <coughs> this exorcist is going to now fight into your aberrance. Now, I might as well take some shooting out of combat. Mm -hmm. I am also degraded. So that mean I'm hitting on sixes. You only degraded once. You're, you're also you're hitting me on fours. You hit on threes normally. Yes. And sustained <gasps> on the heavy bolts. Bang, bang, bang. <gasps> no. Not no a wounds. wound. You big, chunky I'm monkey. I'm so strong. Only four shots with my um, mm -hmm. exorcist rockets. It's two wounds though, minus three. I don't get a save. Nothing. You're gonna have to roll your damage one at a time though. The first damage is two. It's nothing. The second damage is five. Does kill one. One's dead. One. Oh, there's lots left, I'll take the it? imposter. Take oh, it's bla away. Oh, it's not blast. Never take mind. him away. Bye. Bye, imposter. My Paragon War suits yeah. have uh, seem to have left their Prometheum. They did off the board. Uh, you didn't I, kill three of my acolytes. I killed three. Over on the objective. It was okay. Uh, the emulator though is has got so much fire in it. <laughs> They're always like, man, that emulator's got ready loads, to go. so much fire in ready it. Ready to go. Yeah, uh, that's gonna fire into your jeans. Uh -huh. Yes. Um, oh. Sustained. Oh. Sustained. Uh, two wounds. Two wounds. Mm. Damage. Two. Each. It's too dead. <laughs> the immolation flamer. Oh, that's a bit EP. That's fine. That's all right, I suppose. Uh, four wounds. Minus one. Once again. Oh, goodbye. Damage one on this, yes? Yes. You kill another one and a half. <clears throat> Three and a half team stealers gone. All right. My exorcist. My, Your exorcist. My, my random shots are being a little bit on the uh, on the low side today. Yeah. So I've only got six shots of my uh, conflagration. Uh, eyes are looking elsewhere. Yes, he's thinking about all sorts of things. Maybe the fire burned uh, too bright, and now he's got that weird thing where you close your eyes and you can still kind of see the image. A migraine. Yeah. <laughs> the emperor's migraine. Uh, three wounds, please. Three wounds on my gene stealers. Yes. Can you see them? Uh, I can see them. Uh, I damage. Gene stealers. One. Kills one and a half. The heavy bolter. The emperor's heavy bolter. One wound. One wound? Mm. Trick shot didn't work. <gasps> Bang! There's just two genes to this dead. Yes. Just two. Just two. No yeah. one cares. Just two. Just two. That's my shooting done. Oh. These battle sisters are terraforming. They're very busy. How terrible. Mowing the lawn. Oh. Um, it's now time for the charges. Mm -hmm. We're going to start off over there with that immolator. A fiery tank <laughs> shock attempt into your gene stealers. Oh, my fingers crossed did not work. <laughs> I will uncross these. <laughs> Shall I just Probably. do it? Oh, no, I won't do it right now. Uh, the Paragon War suits into the neophytes. <gasps> oh, 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 my goodness. I've, I'm fear. This is the only charge I wanted to happen. So Celestine into the aberrant. It is the tank shock phase. The ta it has its own phase now. <laughs> Let's see. How many genes did it die? I killed two. One, sorry. I killed one. <laughs> okay. That's not so bad. That's one less to worry about. I can live with it. Now my armoured tracks. Oh. Ooh. I don't like it. One wound with the armoured tracks. You've wounded another genes. So I've, I've run. Foot. Oh, he's stuck. Oh. He's flaying about like a pathetic little weasel monster. He's crying. <laughs> the Paragon War Blades. The Paragon War Blades. You'd hope, I mean, maybe I'm short enough that you'll just slice straight over my head. The Paragon War Blades! Okay. Eat my blade. It's gonna be twos to wound to. you. Yeah. We'll What's the AP on it? Uh, two. I will put my dice away. I'm gonna. The I'm Paragon gonna... War Blade. Off with your head. I'm gonna pick the unit. You up filthy now. heretic. But. Oh no. Oh, oh no. According the Paragon War Blade! The Zephyrim. Yeah. The Gemini working together. Combining forces. Yeah. Wings. With embodied prophecy, uh, I've selected lethal hits because you're very tonk. I'm so strong. The so Gemini powerful. 
hit in exactly the same way with their power weapons. They're all at the same time. So I'm going to do these all at the same time. You do you. Many hits. Ooh, the lethals. Why don't I remove those for you? Make it be easier for Thank you. Thank you so much. Help, allow me to assist you in your endeavour of murdering me. Yes. Um, okay. Nice. Okay. Many wounds. You've already wounded me it is six times. Fives to wound you uh -huh. in an ordinary fashion, an undevastating manner. One, right. two, three, four, five, six, seven more. So what's that? Thirteen. Ten. Mm -hmm. Eleven, twelve, thirteen. I don't get a save here because you're AP two, but I do have my five up bonus chains. No damage one. Okay, I've done terribly. Dash. So you've killed one, two, three. <gasps> Three, three, three in total? Three in oh, there's lots left. There are lots left. Well, Katie, three. roll three dice. <gasps> Why? Because on four ups, they three will still get fights. to hit you back. Oh, no. Well, let me do my Ardent Blade. Okay. The Ardent Blade. The Ardent Blade. How ardent of you. The Ardent Blade. <gasps> ardent Blade! Oh, oh bam. I've only no. wanted you once with the Ardent Blade. Damage? Two. One takes a wound. Oh. I'm gonna gear up to hit you back. Oh dear. <laughs> My head's back. Mm. Including the two that have four wounds. Oh no. Hit on threes. Oh, so many skyward oh. hits. Oh, we want you to go back to once you came. The oh. ground is ours, the sky can be yours. We can live in allegiance. This <laughs> is like bat and boom, no back into the sky. You Shoot. did that with my rock rider twice with your mace. I'm moody on twos. Oh, really? Three, four, oh, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16 at minus two. I've made a terrible mistake. At minus two. How many? 16. 16? 16. Minus two? Yeah. The strength blocks. Oh. All right, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten are dead. <laughs> are you saving on? What? What are you saving on? Uh, minus what's the two. minus? Gemini's taken a wound. My abominant. No! <laughs> Max. This has gone horribly wrong. I only hit you three times. Okay. Two, three, would you? Three at minus two. What's. Do they have an invulnerable save? Uh, three. I think it will be four up if it's anything. <gasps> oh, okay, this might be all right. Maybe. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I managed to chip a wound back off you over here. You did. Nothing happened. I've not quite killed the one wound exorcist yet. I had to use a miracle die because you did get a wound through. So I've, I've spent my, my five here yeah. to save him because he is worth five points to you. He is worth and I, I like points. Points yeah. are great. Speaking of which, I've got some points. Yeah. Um, and I will make a point now. I do have a stratagem to reduce AP by one, which I probably should have done in the middle there. But I done a forget. Lessons learnt. Indeed. A very hard lesson because yeah. you killed my entire You'll Zephyrin. never forget ever again. <laughs> ever. Fair, I think based on the rod, it wouldn't have made a huge amount of difference. But anyway, um, I have select, select, successfully sabotaged yeah. uh, that over there, which I'm presuming is a very important uh, piece That was my of, tunnel uh, opening. Ah, yeah. good thing we sabotaged And the gene it. stealers are trapped down there. They might just die. The nearly dead Canoness mm -hmm. has done a great job. Um, and I've also got Assassinate for killing your patriarch. Poor guy. We're now going to carry the head of the patriarch around like an old um, uh, artifact. That's our leader. That's what we like to do. Got around three. Oh my god. I still have marked for death. Two of my Mark for Death targets are on a single wound. Ay ay ay. Strong chances there. And Airy Denial! Hmm. Which means I need to kill Celestine. Hmm. One of those Gemini should be dead, but we'll ignore that. Oh yeah. Blech. So, kill Celestine and kill a vehicle. See how I do. I've resurrected some of the Acolytes with my Icon. Icon. And, and they are just moving. And the Gene Stealers advancing up alongside them, eager to rip and tear their tank. And the squad of neophytes are moving bravely forward so they can get maximum number of shots to be able to see that Paragormore suit on a single wound. Starting the shooting phase with a squad of neophyte hybrids. <coughs> shooting everything into your lone Paragormore suit on a single wound. No. My normal guns have done nothing. However, I've still got my crack grenade and my mining laser. I'm gonna start with Nothing. Not today, Satan. Mining laser. Okay. Rude. <laughs> uh. It's. Uh oh. <laughs> 
wounds. Well, as you shooting it with? Currently nothing. I'm going to use a miracle die for an invulnerable save. Pam. Cool. So, crack grenade from the other squad anyway. <laughs> no! I can reroll it because of the Primus. Hits. Uh huh. Three to wound you. Yes. Minus two. Goo. <laughs> Goo. Oh no! My oh. miracle die! What a waste of a miracle die! She die. She, she, she did dies. Dies. That brings us swiftly to my charge phase. Swift. Very swift. Gene Steelers into your immolator. Might encircle you. And then also the acolytes. I'm going to overwatch them. Yeah, I respect that. They will make it in, so feel free. I will. <gasps> oh! <gasps> Sustain! Ah! Oh, maybe I don't even need the flavour. That's four wounds and minus one! This is unprecedented. I have one left. Wow. Flame Ahoy. Four, five, six, seven. Okay. Four, five, six, seven. Oh, oh one's gone away. Uh, that is four wounds of minus one. He is dead. Hey! However, the gene sealers are still there, though. <laughs> oh back? no, don't come back. Oh. They listened, but the gene sealers will tear you apart. Nice. Well, my gene sealers. I had fifty attacks again, so we did it off camera. Eleven wounds have gone through. Uh. Eleven of them. Minus two. Uh. I done all right Ooh, actually. Oh, you've not done too badly. Done right, but has taken seven wounds. Seven wounds. So he's down to three. He is down so to I three. I have degraded it. Yeah. That's good for me. Well, I mean, it's got a flame on it. It doesn't matter that much. But the heavy bolt has been doing some work to do. Shh. A lot of them to fight off. <laughs> no lethal this time <laughs> either. <laughs> um, it's also worth mentioning I did spend a one point on Gene Twister Bustle over there. I forgot to mention it. I was booing your vibes. That's why they were so killing. Yeah. That makes all the sense in the world. I've hit you every single time. Fear me. Yes. No, you fear me. I My wound you one bound. time. AP. Two. No save. Sword. Damage. One. I take a wound. All right. One's down to a wound. The Ardent Blade. Okay. The Ardent Blade. I've hit you every <gasps> She is very powerful. She's very ardent. <laughs> Makes sense. Just the two wounds. Damage. Two. One is dead. And one takes a wound. Aye, aye, aye. Does the one that died hit you back? No, that's it. Ooh. But I will now hit you back with everything else. <laughs> the abominants will hit you back then. Uh, you've killed quite enough. <laughs> yep, you don't want me to do anymore. No. Commit on threes. Uh. <laughs> you threes oh, I've spent a CP on the Shield of Aversion. Yeah, that makes sense. Try yes. to stay alive. Yeah. Uh, two to wound you. Just two, Tis. is it? Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. At minus one, because you should have a version. I may as well throw these all at the same time, because... Same save? Same save. Go for it. Twelve, you Twelve. say? Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So these will be three ups. Oh, it's all right! So the Gemini is kaput. Uh-huh. And Celestine has three wounds left. The Abominant will take mm, No! The Abominant! <gasps> Ooh. Oh, has she dodged out the way? Maybe. It's two. Ooh. Minus AP. one, because you're a shield of aversion. Minus one. Oh, what's the damage? Three. Three? Three. Oh. She left? No, she's dead. She had three wounds back. left. She does come back. Well, there's nothing else to do this turn, is there? One or two up. One or two plus. Oh. Suspense. Yes. Angelically. Angelically. Li, 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 li. We do still have the combat with the tank and the veneer fights, but no. we'll resolve that. I'm the one down here. No. Nah. We resolved the final bits of combat off camera. I've done two more wounds to your tank over here and your exorcist on one wound is still standing. Just about. Just about. Now that comes to the end of my turn, I do get my marked for death because your Paragon War suit is dead. You failed it. I don't get area denial because Celestine stood back up. Yeah. back up. Yeah. Like Why am I? She has a one. She's got She's all of healthy, her wings. Healthy lady. Healthy gal. Good for her. Yeah. Oh no, she <laughs> fell. Oh, no. Stand up, Celestine. <laughs> don't embarrass us. <laughs> well, maybe she'll embarrass you in your turn. <laughs>
brutal bludgeoning. <laughs> and Which she deserved. She, I mean, maybe. And she's also brought a little mate with us. She's come back to life. She cried on her corpse. <laughs> and now she's come back to life. Yeah. Which is disturbing. That would bring me back to life if I died. If someone cried on my corpse. So, if I ever die, now you know. Um, I've drawn Defend Stronghold and Extend Metal Lines. <laughs> I just realised how weird that was. That was really weird. <laughs> Sorry. Really weird. But at least we weren't recording it on video and it's going to go on the internet or anything. Um, <laughs> defend and Extend is entirely possible. I mean, I've already on my home objective. And you've already extended with a sticky. Yes, you do have some stuff down here, but they're a bit stuck fighting an exorcist. A little bit. You see. Uh, but there are some aberrants that do need to be flamed real hard. Like, please don't. Mm -mm. The Retributors are going to fling back this way to save Celestine. More saving to do. These Battle Sisters are going to move down this way to try to save the Exorcist. The Hero Canadas, after finishing the Sabotage mission, is going to come back over here and fight a giant swarm of gene stealers. What a legend. The Paragon War Suits turn to face the Neophyte Mutants. And finally, these sisters move down here to hold back the Ravening Horde. The Cleansing Flames. Yeah, Brits, don't like being clean. Well, I'm going to burn all of them off anyway. No. Um, I've like done Cleansing Flames toxic messes. for free once again because of my cannabis, which is nice. Legend. Um, I got a lot of flame. Yeah. A lot of flame coming in. That was absurd. So I get lethals. I got three, three, three lethals. No, three... Devastating? Yes. Because you've already hit, because you're a flamer. Yeah, because a flamer. This These must be Devi wounds. What am I reading? I don't know. <laughs> um, but that is otherwise. With the minus one? If you, are you stronger than me? No. Uh, yes, because yes? it's strength seven now. Um, but so it is force. on fours. So seven wounds and then four Devies, please. Minus? One. So sixes? OK, and then your damage? One. So there's six Devies, yeah? Yeah. One, two, three, four. Uh, four Devies. Four. Five up there, okay. Mm-hmm. Go, oh, Aberrants, go, go, go. Of, that's go, a lot of... Aberrants, go, go, go. Oh. So one was out to a wound. Okay. So that is one dead. Yeah. And then one more dead. Yeah. And then one more wounded. Oh, they're so strong. Yeah. <laughs> After her desiccated corpse is suitably cried upon, <laughs> which grants her revitalization, <laughs> Yeah. As she flies away, well, Ooh. to re-engage herself, Ooh. she's left a holy hand grenade Ooh. at the feet of the aberrants. Ooh. Yeah. Shiny. Grenade strat. Shiny. Oh. <gasps> oh. <laughs> oh, that's six? <laughs> that's a very potent grenade! Oh, five, six, I've got my feel no pains. Do they feel it? Ooh. Oh. I guess they did literally pick it up. Yeah. So that... Wow. One left in the abominant. It was signed by the other Gemini as well. And then I have six uh, flames from the Ardent Blade okay. as well. Okay. Rolling hot in the Ardent Blade. Yeah. Brrr, ding, ding, ding. Brrr. That is five wounds at minus one. Grenade and flame blade indeed hot. Six up. Oh. Damage. One. Oh, hello. Four sixes. <laughs> Can't fight me. <laughs> <sighs> okay then. A few extra shots. The exorcist over here with the confederation uh, has killed a number of your neophytes over mm -hmm. there. Uh, I've, yeah, four, four have gone from the squad. Which is nice. Uh, this exorcist just did a shot into uh, the neophytes down there with, with, with Mrs. Brain. Killed one. And I think that's everything. It's time for some charges. Yeah. Now. Paragon Warsuit's going to charge into those ne 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 neophyte hybrids. Well, good thing they're so close because they just about make it in. Um, the Battle Sisters over there will make it in. Yeah. Celestine can't really fail. fail. Uh, they can't really fail. I mean, nothing can really fail. Let's just move it all in, it all in. Ah. A few little fighting summaries. Um, the Battle Sisters down here managed to kill four of the neophytes, but did lose one in return. Yeah. yeah. No. Um, over there, the Paragon War suits, absolutely. No, no, we're not going to talk about it. And no, they're not coming back. No. No, they're not coming back. No, they, they never existed. No. Down here, I spent a miracle die for my palatine to give rapturous blows. So kill two, then kill two more. Yeah. Now the hero canoness. 
She's been battered. She's done some battering. She's sabotaged. Not ready for it. She's crawled over here and with the last of her strength. She's gonna spend my last three miracle die for right. She is range. hoping for a miracle. Yeah. Yeah. So I've got eight attacks. Okay. He's gonna be a strength six with a uh, with a with a hollow. Still only on threes then. Uh, it'd be strength six. So yes, yes. Oh, that's not bad. That is uh, five wounds. Five. Only minus one. Invul invulnerable. I'm not invulnerable. What's the damage? <laughs> damage one. So yes, two are dead because one's oh, already wounded. What a legend. Well, She's going to get ruined in a second, but what a yeah. way to go. I'm going to eat her soul. <laughs> <laughs> She's still swinging. Just about. For now. For now. We'll start off with uh, Celestine's Gemini. Okay. Our so little gal pal. Little gal pal doing little, 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 pal. little, little, little things. Oh, it's three wounds. Okay. Minus two. Minus two. I don't get a save. What's your damage? Damage one. Five up. <gasps> she yeah. killed the last the one. The is dead. Oh. Two. Does the unit come back? Oh, God. Oh. The Abominant does still stand. For now, yeah. the Arden Blade. The Arden Blade. Hits you all the times with the uh. Arden Blade. It will die with the Arden uh. Blade. It, oh. Oh, okay. Oh. It's one of those devastating wounds. I'm not sure. You, I'll be back. you, 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 you. Katie, you, does that aberrant um, still get to fight? Oh. Yes, the aberrant will get to fight you. No, great so news. Fear him. Wonderful news. There's devastating wounds. What's your AP? Uh, th hang on. <laughs> roll your da roll your damage, because I just have feel no pains. I'm AP three. Roll your damage. Oh, it's damage two. Oh, so four. Yes. Five up. Yep. I only take two wounds on the other Just the two? Just the oh, two wounds. My body. And my aberrant will get to fight you back. Oh, it fights back! The aberrant can fight you back. No! <laughs> start things off with the aberrant that you did just kill. I did. He wins your little times. Uh oh. He wins your little times. Uh oh. Three at minus two. Invulnerable save! Oh, oh no, that's so good! You fell all of them? Yeah! So the Gemini's dead and, and Celestine's taken four wounds. Yeah, she's got a wound left. The Abominant. No! He will. <laughs> murder. Oh, he's powered up. Okay. So he's still wounds you. Uh-huh. Two wounds. Two wounds. Minus two. I've got a miracle dice left! Two wounds. Two she's wounds. got one wound left. Yeah. What's the AP? Two. Leave two, four up in front of them, saves. The light of the Emperor. Oh, you dog! She's <laughs> you fine! Are you on the car of the Emperor! You can keep flying ah. around! <laughs> <laughs> Nothing has happened down here with the Gene Stealers and the Immolator. Down here, the Gene Stealers attacked another Immolator and nothing. Mm -mm. But three of them turn to face the Cannoness. Uh -oh. With their chittering claws, Got that. Oh. they hit you every single time. Oh. Every single time. She would have wanted to go this way. Hungry. Yeah. Hungry full of blood. Yes. Yes. Two, four, six, eight, please. Minus two. She's been made a martyr. Yeah. Minus two. Mm -hmm. Oh. Well, it's a good thing is she's right next to the immolator, so um, if she wants to go in quite highly and devout way, you could just... Just immolate her. Yeah. I feel, feel like that would be a good way to yeah. make her a martyr. Straight to cremation. Very, yeah. very, very efficient. <laughs> really, really efficient. <laughs> That's a turn complete. It's quite a potent turn, that one. A little bit. A little bit potent. It's hot. Yeah, warm, yeah. spicy. Yeah. Um, I managed to get an extend because yeah. we've got a stacky objective over there from those battle sisters. They always come in handy. Mm -hmm. um, and I am still on my home objective over here um, and should have that in the next turn for defense. Yeah, realistically, well. I can't actually uh, fall back with enough movement to get onto the objective, so yeah. I can't stop you getting defend. Indeed. Now we're going into battle round four. <laughs> battle round four. Uh. I still have area denial, which is possible if I kill Celestine. Indeed. And I drew defend stronghold. I'm not currently holding my stronghold, and it's going to be very difficult for me with two gene stealers to try and kill your paragon war suits. It's quite a lot over to, there. To, to, to get you off my stronghold. So that's no bueno. And also <laughs> the amount of my stuff that is dead. So I've got no blips on the table, so I can't bring anything back. There's nothing to bring back at the moment. And realistically, 
I don't think my stuff's going to be of much use because you can just essentially not attack me to not bring me back. It's so all, I, yeah, it's all, it's all quite chunky. I've given myself a goal. Okay. Kill Celestine Ooh. for the moral victory. Mm. And then we'll see where things lay out after that. So I'm just going to go straight into it. Nice. Okay? With my abominant. I'd be hitting you first, wouldn't I? You hit me first, it's fine. <laughs> me first. Can I hit you? Yes, four times. Can I wound you? Twice times. Uh, what's your tough? Tough six. Oh, yeah. Yeah, twice times. Five times. Damage two each? Yes. So four wounds? Yes. Four, five up, four no pains. Ay, 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 ay. a single wound. Oh. So I will strike you back. Oh. So I will, if that's okay. It's, uh, I mean, yes. She's got one wound left. She's got one wound left. Hit you three times. Okay. It's two wounds. Oh, I've got a bit. Huh? It's two wounds. It's two wounds. You can right. use a miracle die if you want. I've got one miracle die left from the beginning of this turn, which is a five, which is a powerful number. The AP is what? Two. <gasps> My Celestine. Oh. It would have been five damage. Oh. It would have been five damage. Savage. So she does go down. She's finally dead. She does get me the area denial. She's killed by an finally. abomination. Quite literally. Yeah. An abomination. However, I think I might be a little bit on the ropes. Maybe. <laughs> maybe. Maybe. Right. Mm. Well. Mm. I'm a bit in a bit of a tricky position. The only things that I have on the board that could potentially come back are two units of gene stealers and two units of neophytes, both of which aren't in great positions, both of which kind of aren't being threatened enough to actually be able to roll to come back. Yeah. And even if you kill them and they come back, they're coming back at the end of your turn four or in your turn four, so I can't do anything with them until about around five. Yeah. Now that ends me on, I believe, 46 points. Yeah. And you've taken all the objectives. I'm afraid so. I apart from the middle one, which apart is from the being... One. Being, uh, that is mine. Yeah. I claimed it. That is for aberrant. <laughs> aberrant mine. Uh, which can be quite easily dealt with with some parry on suits jetting off over there and charging him. Probably, with, with, yeah. With, with some murder. And he now can't come back. He could potentially stand back up, but he can't come back. And I just, I don't have the resources left mm. to be able to catch you on the points. Um, my stuff's not really coming back. And it's not really doing anything. Everything's mm. in combat with tanks. And all the tanks have got big flamers on them, generally speaking. Big and scary. Yeah. Big and scary. So, we'll be conceding. What Thank a wonderful game. game. That was fun. This was really, really fun. G-Stealer cults are quite interesting, They're aren't very they? interesting. Mm. I'm kind of seeing what uh, the other team members are saying when it's like, you get to bed around three and you kind of know where it's going with G-Stealer cults. Yeah. And I understand, because at that point, if you bring anything back with a cult ambush, it's not coming back until your turn five, essentially, in terms yeah. of being able to use it. Mm. So it, you can tell with the resources you've got available what you're actually going to be able to do in the future turns. Yeah. I kind of really lost momentum, and a lot of that, I think, was due to not rolling to bring stuff back. Yeah. Because bringing those two squads of gene stealers back made a massive difference. Yeah, and I think I if, you, them. If, you, if, we, if we'd been able to have run, like, max gene stealers, yes. that would have potentially been a very different uh, but, outcome. This detachment, I think, was max gene stealers and maybe two squads of um, aberrants. Yeah. It is quite horrible if you're if you're lucky spot, on yeah. the if you're lucky on the rolls as well to bring them back because you rush forward with the gene seers, it doesn't matter if they die if they come back because then they can rush back up the field you can um, put your blips in nice safe places and you've got the strap to be able to move it around which is really cool and the abominants just kind of stick things in place yes they do yeah <laughs> <laughs> yeah so there's an it's a nice little um, here's really fast and then here's really like unkillable yeah there's a nice combination I had a lot of fun playing with it yeah. Yeah, they were the fun to play against. Holy well. Flame. The Holy Flame is good, yes. This Ooh. has got a nice little boost. Um, it was fun using some units I'm not used for a while. Hmm. The Palatine's really good. I don't think she changed, actually, in, in, the, in the Codex. She's just but, cool. Um, she is just cool. With... Yeah, the, this attachment is very good, I think, yes. with all of the flame. Um, the Assault as well on all of your weapons it just gives you the flexibility. Yeah, really, that didn't come up that much no. in this game. Um, I kind of came towards you, though. So. You did, yeah. yeah. I think if you're going towards a different style of army and you can assault, like, move things up really quick in the yeah. first couple of battle rounds, you can be 
danger close and with the strats where you can like get out of transports and do the flame flame yeah they're good fun nice little nice little toolkit indeed as it were. and the new missions were fun as well yeah really cool it was really really nice yeah. uh, the terraforming was a fun little aspect of yeah. having actions having actions reactions again is very good yes um and the secondaries i felt actually seemed to like they were things you would do in a battle they're quite immersive yeah yeah the, just even the naming of them yeah sounds so much better sabotage that thing you did yeah. i marked you for death you did i killed you i'm dead you're dead I'm dead now i'm dead too oh we're both dead we're in the afterlife dead. having a Great time. Celestine's dead. Seven little cry. Dead, dead, dead. Dead, dead, dead. Yes. Well, that was a lot of fun. That was a lot of fun. Thank you. If you'd like much. to see more of this stuff, including two more battle reports, the faction focuses. And a whole review of the new mission pack. Yeah. And all of the other faction focuses for all of the other fo f factions for the come out for already. 10th edition. Mm -hmm. And all the other games that we do, head over to On Demand. Sign up. Join the community. There's loads of stuff on there. Yeah. And our podcast. Everything. Everything's there. Um, and we'll be back very soon for more games right here on Phoebe as well. So stay tuned for that. If you haven't already, hit subscribe. Don't miss anything. Hit like if you liked it. Leave a comment. Give us your opinion on these two new factions. We'd love to hear yeah. about it or read about time. it. I had a good time. Good. Thank you to our servo skull. Beepity boop. Thank you to you. Thank you to you. Thank you to me. Yeah. And thank you. We'll see you all here very, very soon. Bye. Bye.